The big question is, what's your rules of success? When you visit my website www.infinitespace.co.ke and on my blogs you find a post on rules of success. I took time to read through the rules of success of some of the people like Joel Austin, Lisa Nichols, Oprah Winfrey, Warren Buffett, and many more. And this means that they have guiding principles, rules that lead them to where they are and to the roadmap of where they want to be. Do you have rules of success? No. What is success? This is the giant in the room. Success could be defined as getting married by the age of 30. A young couple can define success as getting a baby. A young man or woman can define success as thriving in their career. So success really depends on how you look at it. And for you to be able to get to that point, there's always a plan. What leads you to that? Let me tell you my rules of success. Passion, purpose, service. Passion is that thing you love doing. It gets overwhelming sometimes, very tiring. You rack your brain too much, but still, you love doing it and you'd wake up to do it over and over again. Now, purpose. What is purpose? I'm a strong believer that everyone was born for a purpose. When I was reading the book by Miles Monroe, Unleash Your Purpose, some time back, I came across a very interesting concept. Miles Monroe gives the scenario of an inventor. The person who invented the mobile phone decided that they had to put all the functionalities that would en enable that person to text, call, and do everything that that mobile phone is designed to do. That's the same thing God did with every human being. When he created you and me, he put in us every functionality that we need to fulfill our purpose. Have you ever taken time to think about what your purpose could be? That's my second rule of success. Service. How do you think of service? When I was reading this book, one of the books I'm reading currently, I came across a very interesting quote by Rabin Ranath Tagore. I slept and dreamt that life was joy. I awoke and saw that life was service. I acted and behold, service was joy. Service directs my life in such a way that I don't report to work every day because I get paid. I don't give my best in my work every day because there's a peril, I'm in the peril, or there's a paycheck at the end of the month. Well, I need that money, don't get me wrong, but I don't work to be paid. What informs your decision to offer yourself in service to others? We are living in a world where everything is about What's in it for me? What am I getting in this deal? And before you ask yourself, how can I be of service? What can I give? It's always about what can I receive? And then you realize that you live your whole life having no joy at all because your decisions are not informed by service. When I was starting Infinite Space, I had a lot in my mind and this kept coming to my mind and my heart until I could not hold it any longer. One of my passion and very great passion as I said is to influence action for transformation. Now that might sound very vague but sometimes action is as little as you want to cut your tummy just wake up in the morning, do five minutes 
of exercise. That is action. Action could be you want to build your knowledge, kindly start reading books. Action could be you've been influenced all of your life by people around you who have made you limit your potential or have denied you the chance to even know what your potential is and unleash it. My influence of action is to make you reach out to that person inside and bring them out because it is always in the inside, not the outside. And as I make this video and I share this with you, I feel a lot of joy because to me that is service. I realize that I love talking, by the way, <laughs> ever since I was a baby. I was that kind of a girl that my mother would say, go and keep the guests busy. And the guests would wait for my mom and not really feel like they have waited for long. I would entertain them. I would bond with them very easily. I have grown up, I've grown up in different parts of my life, different aspects, growing myself in line of communication, leading, and being able to connect with people. And I've realized that is not something that is very normal to everyone. So here I am. And I'm asking you a very simple yet complicated question. What is success to you? And what are the rules of our success? Let me tell you what success is to me. It is simply put as living and fulfilling my purpose. Some of you will ask, actually most of you will ask, how do you know then your purpose? I welcome you as we explore this subject in our next video on discovering your purpose. Thank you.